start a rice meal business in India. Rice is a staple food for over half of the world's population. With India being the second largest producer and consumer of rice globally, the country presents a major opportunity for setting up a rice milling business. Welcome to our channel. In this business guide, we teach you how to start this business from zero. By the end of this video, you will understand where and how to begin, potential hurdles and the resources and time required. Visit our website for a detailed overview and download the full business guide for your reference. Have questions or want another business guide? Call or WhatsApp 9804282819 or 9433889819. If you need tailored guidance and advice, we offer personalized consultations. Our experts will evaluate your specific business idea and needs. We will provide custom recommendations to help you assess the feasibility of your business plan, identify potential hurdles and solutions, create projections and forecasting, access financing and prepare paperwork, launch and grow your new business successfully. Contact us anytime to get started. Call or WhatsApp us with questions. We look forward to helping you build the business of your dreams. Now, let's continue the video and dive into the details. Rice milling involves processing paddy to removing the outer husk and inner brown layers to produce white rice grains ready for cooking. The husk and brown account for 20 to 30 percent of paddy's weight. Traditionally, milling was done manually but now specialized machines are used to hull, clean, polish and grade rice on a large commercial scale. The capital investment required depends on a scale of operations. A micro rice mill handling 1 to 2 tons of paddy per day can be started with less than 25 lakhs investment. A small scale 5 ton per day mill may require 50 to 75 lakhs. Medium sized operations handling 25 to 100 tons daily need investments in the range of multiple crores. The major equipment in a modern rice mill comprises of cleaners to remove impurities, stone separators, hullers or shellers to remove husks brawn, removing systems like whiteners and polishes, grading sieves and packaging systems. A well-run mill can achieve gross profit margins around 20% on the turnover. The husk separated during milling is commonly used as animal feed or fuel. The nutritious brown layer has applications in oil extraction. Hence, byproducts also provide additional revenue streams. However, rice milling faces challenges like obtaining paddy supplies at reasonable prices consistently. Environmental factors like water availability, soil conditions and climate impacts on yields affect production volumes. Proper storage processing, packaging and distribution logistics are also critical. But with India's steady paddy output over 110 million tons annually and domestic demand from a huge population, the fundamentals remain strong. Rising export potential in basmati and other rice varieties also brightens the outlook. Success depends on factors like strategic location, efficient milling machinery, working capital management, supply chain coordination and astute marketing of rice products for B2B or B2C segments. Adopting enhanced rice varieties and technologies can also improve milling recoveries and quality. Rice will continue to be essential to food security. With detailed planning, calculated investments, operational excellence and adaptable business strategies, rice milling in a major rice producing nation like India offers attractive prospects. The sector has seen growing consolidation and emergence of large milling companies. But small and mid-sized players can also thrive with focus on productivity, quality, cost optimization and customer satisfaction. 